Hello friends, welcome to News Daily. My name is Delali Frank and the channel is Del Soccer. Today, we're going to talk about the Black Stars. The head coach has released the squad. It has a 24-month squad for the next African Cup of Nations qualifiers. And I'm here to give you the names. Some few names are absent and there are some few additions. We're going to talk about it, but if it's your first time, please hit on the subscription button. And let's build this community together. But without wasting much time, let's get straight into today's video. So uh, let's start with the most important thing. So the head coach has released a squad that is the 24-man squad for Ghana's next African Cup of Nations. The game is going to happen on June 18 against Madagascar. That's Ghana's first game after the club season has come to an end. Is, uh, is an interesting call up, you know, pretty much literally players that we've been expecting them to be there and some few players that has also been dropped. But we're going to start with uh, the goalkeepers. We have Lawrence Satizigi, who plays for St. Gallen, happens to be St. Gallen's best uh, goalkeeper and also the best goalkeeper in his region. And also Joseph Wallacott, who has not had enough playing time in the last few games. And then Abdul Manaf Nuruddin, who has also not played literally a game the defenders we have Dennis Odwell who plays for Club Bridge there's Ali Duseidu who is coming back pretty much very happy for Ali Duseidu who plays for Clermont Fort there's Gideon Mensa of Oxia there's Patrick Gozo of Sheriff there's uh, Daniel Amate who plays for Leicester City unfortunately they've gone on relegation there's uh, Joseph Edu who plays for Seta Vigo there's Aleza Dajiku who, who plays for Strasbourg, and then there's Nicolas Opoku. Remember that Nicolas Opoku was initially caught when um, Salisu was injured. So immediately that Salisu is not here. And I think Salisu's absence may also be a confirmation that the young man has not really been fit for for his club football. In the midfield, there's, there's obviously Thomas Party. It's good to see him in the national team. Uh, there's Mohamed Kudus. Uh, there's... Majid Ashimeri, who made a strong case for himself when he played in the last game. There's Salis Abdul Samet, who happens to be French's best defensive midfielder currently. And then there's Edmond Edu. I think Edmond Edu, a lot of people believe he's not had a good game for the Black Stars. But if you look at the role and where he plays, he's a defensive midfielder. We don't have, as currently, I think we've also not seen enough from. Uh, we've not seen enough from Baba Idrisu. That is why he has not also been called. But if you look at defensive midfielders in our team, apart from Salis, we need a backup for Salis. And whenever we think of getting a backup for Salis, it's Edmond Edu that comes in mind. And that's why he's always present in our, in our team. The wingers, we have Joseph Pencil, we have Usman Bukhari. Obviously, the two go to guys as far as our wingers is concerned joseph Penso, usman bukhari kamadin Suleimana, and Nesunyama, and that's the surprising one like the ad recent addition which is in the Sunyama. the young man has been brilliant for nojaland he was part of the u23 and this time around got a call up into the national team i think he deserves it he deserves it and then the attackers we have andrea you andrea you used to be andrea you is now with the Nottingham Forest considered as a forward, an attacker, obviously. Jordan Ayu, Inake Williams, and then Kwesi Ochi Red. I think Kwesi Ochi has been a bit out of the team. The last call-up, he was not part, but he gets a chance to be part of it. Some few players that has not been in this addition, I think one of notable amongst them is, uh, is Kamal Sowa. Yes, Kamal Sowa. I was looking for Kamal Sowa to mention. I think... He is the one that is not here now. If you look at the team, predominantly, basically, uh, players that have been in and around the team, no surprise name, apart from Ernest, who happens not to be uh, a regular player in the team, who is having his debut. Most all of these players have been in and around the Blacks. And I think gradually, gradually, I think we are, we are, we are having our core Black Stars. There are players that will return if they are fit they easily come into the national team would be let's say Tariq Lamte, Salisu you know these are players that if they are fit they would obviously have a chance into the team 
with our goalkeeping, I think for now, Atiziki happens to be our number one. Obviously, going to be our number one. So, this is Chris Hutton's team. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Your opinion is there any other player that deserves to be here? Still, there's no Ghanaian, there's no player in the Ghana Premier League that stands a chance of making it. Let me know what you think in the comment section. But I'll meet again. Uh, bye bye for now.